హాయ్ ఎవ్రీ వన్ వెల్కమ్ టు అవర్ ఛానల్ మ్యాథ్ టైమ్ విత్ ధనప్రసాద్ ఈ వీడియోలో మీకోసం మ్యాథమెటిక్స్ నుంచి సెకండ్ చాప్టర్ సెట్స్ నుంచి టూ థౌజండ్ నైన్టీన్ ఓల్డ్ క్వశ్చన్ అండ్ ఆన్సర్స్ డీటెయిల్డ్గా సాల్వ్ చేసి ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ చేశాను మీరు క్వశ్చన్ బై క్వశ్చన్ జాగ్రత్తగా ఫాలో అవ్వండి మంచి మార్క్స్ వస్తాయి ఈ వీడియో మీకు నచ్చితే మీ ఫ్రెండ్స్కి కూడా షేర్ చేయండి వాళ్ళు మీరు కూడా ఒకే కాలేజీలో పాలిటెక్నిక్ జాయిన్ అవ్వచ్చు Question number 1. The cardinal number of a set A equal to 1 to 4 is. So here option 1 is 1, option 2 is 4, option 3, uh, 2, option 4, 3. Now first while reading the question you have to get the hint or the formula related to this problem. The cardinal number of a set. What is cardinal number of a set? We discussed in important points. Cardinal number of a set is simply the number of elements in a set. For example, here in the given problem, number of elements of A equal to how many elements are there in A? 1, 2, 4. Total 1, 2, 3. 3 elements are there. Therefore, the cardinal number of the set is 3. Option 4 is right answer. So, therefore, cardinal number means the number of the total number of elements. Here, 3 elements are there. So, therefore, the total number of elements of A equal to 3, therefore, answer is 3. Therefore, option 4, option 4 is right because option 4, we have the cardinal number 3. Now, question number 2, if A equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and B equal to 4, 5, 6, then A intersection B equal to option 1, A, option B, option 2, B, option 3, 4, 5, option 4, 1, 2, 3. What is A intersection B? A intersection B may, union means all the elements of A and B together. Intersection means the elements of A and B. Intersection means common elements. Here the common elements are 4, 5, 4, 5. In A and B, the elements 4 and 5 are common. Therefore, our answer is 3. So, A intersection B means by Venn diagrams also I can show it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This is A, this is B. In A, we have 5 elements. In B, we have 3 elements. The elements 4 and 5 are common. They are in intersection. Therefore, option 3 is the right answer. Number 3 is A minus B union B minus A. Here, this is one formula. So, you have to carefully observe this. A minus B union B minus A is equal to how much option 1 a union b option 2 a intersection b option 3 non empty set pi option 4 a union b minus a intersection b so when we have good grip on formulas uh, what we discussed in earlier the answer is 4 a union b minus a intersection b how let us see what is a minus b so, I would like to explain you with, uh, with uh, Venn diagrams. A minus B is this and B minus A is this. B minus A is this. So, this is A. This is B. So, this is A minus B. The elements belongs to A and doesn't belongs to B. So, B minus A means the elements belongs to B, not belongs to A. This is A minus B. This is B minus A. What is their union? Union means A minus B union B minus A. Intersection part not covered. This part is not covered. Therefore, A minus B, B minus A. Union is what? A union B minus A intersection B. A union B means what is A union B? A union B is this, right? A union B. A union B is this. Elements of A are B. So, A minus B is this part. B minus A is this part. Intersection is not covered. Therefore, A union B minus A intersection B is the right answer. Question number 4. If A is the set formed by the letters of the word possessiveness. Here, A is a set which is formed by the letters of the word possessiveness then n of a equal to how much means number of elements in a equal to how much means 
the cardinal number of a is what so here first let us write a equal to so repeated letters we no need to write in a set here p o p o in double s here from s s i will take one s i will take i v e i v e and also n so here p is there in the set o is there in the set yes so repeated as uh, repeated elements or numbers we should not uh, take so for all these ss i am taking only one s i i have taken v e n i have taken e is already taken here so therefore 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 number of elements in a nothing but cardinal number of this set a is 7 answer 1 is right answer so therefore whenever a word is given you have to take unrepeated letters and you have to you can you have to count them the number of different letters is what cardinal number of the set means number of elements in a so option 1 is right answer question number 5 is if n of a equal to 8 and n of b equal to 9 and n of a intersection b equal to 6 then what is n of a union b is equal to how much means the question the question is that if number of elements in a is 8 number of elements in b 9 elements number of elements in a intersection b 6 elements i want number of elements in a union b we have one important formula n of a union b equal to n of a plus n of b minus n of a intersection b so i already gave you this formula in important formulas so here number of elements in a union b equal to n of a is equal to how much 8 plus n of b 9 minus 6 8 plus 9 17 17 minus 6 11 so answer 3 is right answer so n of a union b this is very very important formula you have to remember this n of a union b is n of a plus n of b minus n of a intersection b is right answer so therefore answer 3 is right answer question number 6 how many subsets of the set p equal to a e i o u will have so here one set p is given p contains a e i o u five elements take n of p number of elements in the set p equal to 5 now we want the number of subsets how many subsets the, the set p will have so here the number of subsets p will have equal to 2 power formula 2 power 5 equal to 32 your answer is answer 4 so here number of subsets of the given set is the number of elements so 2 power 2 power the number of elements the set has so we can take one formula like this for example number of elements n of p equal to r then the number of subsets is what 2 power r means 2 power 5 nothing but what 32 so therefore the formula for the number of subsets not the elements the number of subsets of a set is given by 2 power r where r is number of elements in the set 